These are going to be my week nine NFL straight up game predictions. My week eight record was 12 and four. Overall record on the season, we're sitting at 84 and 39. For anybody that wants to talk shit about us making straight up picks, fuck you. This is our channel. We do picks with spreads in other videos, so you should follow us. Please. Texans at Jets. Rest in peace to Stefan Diggs knee. But I said it last week. If the Jets lose, I'm not picking them for the rest of the season. Fuck them. Texans. Rip your fantasy team. Patriots at Titans. Both these teams are dog shit. I think the Patriots are just a little bit less dog shit. Patriots. Dolphins at Bills. I think the Dolphins are progressively getting back to where they want to be. They're still not there yet, but the Bills have also progressively been getting better throughout the season. I like the Bills here at home. Bills. Raiders at Bengals. The Raiders are still in shambles. The Bengals really need a bounce back. Bengals. Broncos at Ravens. I had a really tough time picking this game this week because the Ravens did not look good last week and the Broncos did. I'm going to take an upset win here for the Broncos. Broncos. Chargers at Browns. Famous Jameis is back, baby. You step in and take down the Ravens who were red hot. I'm going to roll with that. Browns. Colts at Vikings. So the Colts have not figured much out this season, and the Vikings are probably pissed after their loss last week to the Rams. I'm going to roll with the Vikings here in a huge win. Vikings. I still love you, Colts. Go Colts. <laughs> Jaguars at Eagles. It hurts my soul to say, but the Eagles might be back. Get fucked. Fuck them. The Jaguars, on the other hand, apparently don't know shit about fuck. I'm going to roll with the Eagles here. Fuck them. Eagles. God, I hate them. I hate the fucking Eagles so much. I ugh. Buccaneers at Chiefs. Casey mentioned this in his picks as well. If the Bucks were fully healthy, they're not. Their wide receiver one is Sterling Shepard. Give me the Chiefs here on Monday night. Chiefs. Sterling Shepard, goddamn. Commanders at Giants. First of all, fuck them both. The Commanders should beat the shit out of the Giants, but this is an NFC East matchup and it's in New Jersey. I think I'd be stupid to not pick the Commanders here, so I'm going to, but this game could be closer than most people expect. Commanders. Cowboys at Falcons. We need to just start skipping the Cowboys picks. <laughs> uh, How angry do they make you? So much to say, but it will never do anything because Jerry's still bagging his money. Falcons. Saints at Panthers. Yuck. The Saints are still battling injuries like they have for most of this season, but the Panthers fucking suck, dog. Saints. Bears at Cardinals. Anyone that's been following the Caleb Williams hate, it has dissipated. I don't hate him. What? Bears should have won that game against the Commanders. Instant karma for that corner that was talking shit to the fans. Get fucked. Bears win this week in Arizona, though. Bears. Rams at Seahawks. This game could be a tough divisional rivalry, but the Rams look like a whole fucking different team with Cooper Cup and Puka Nakua back. Even their defense was lighting shit up. I'm gonna roll with the Rams in this one. Rams. They needed more Puka. Lions at Packers. This is undoubtedly the game of the week. The Lions have been red, red hot. However, the Packers in Lambeau are a different Packers team. I'm going to roll with the Packers in this one in a tough divisional matchup. Close game. Brandon McManus, last second field goal again. Book it. He called it last time, folks. Packers. 